hello i know i don't want to waste any more time you know by just saying i don't know why my face just looks like i'm crying but i didn't cry um my i don't know what to call this immature um immature beard it's growing very badly um but i never uh, i'm thankful for it you know uh, that's for sure um there is a lamp blowing like you can see like there is a lamp here only on my desk uh, so yeah it's my english tuition time guys <laughs> um yeah so it's about i got a clock i got a watch um it's 10 22 by 37 uh, but that means is uh 1037 <laughs> i have walked 5595 steps today um it's sunday um 26 december yeah and my watch has 31% you know 31% battery um uh, charging whatever you want to say i really like to pull up my sleeves okay uh, i don't have any topic to speak but uh, i have to speak something okay um let's say so i i don't think so like last time i didn't make uh, another video uh the second you know i make two videos per day but tomorrow like the previous class i didn't the previous tuition i didn't you know uh talked about a topic that i wanted to talk and i'm still not talking about it so i want to talk about this topic uh that is uh, i have uh, discovered a new uh what do you call author of books uh, and his name is uh, Patrick Nietzsche uh, his name is very complicated but people call him like uh, people call him Nietzsche um as you it's two words if you want to pronounce it correctly if you want to be vocabularily correct you know politically correct vocabulary vocabulary correct um, it's ni like your ni Nietzsche, 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 and why do I want to talk about it? Um, uh, because uh, first of all, I want to put a precaution sign <laughs> uh, that not everybody should uh, read uh, his, you know, uh, his his work, his work, yeah, because he is author, his work. Um, but because uh, it's uh, you know, it's, first of all, he is very you know like rude. Uh, you know not everybody is uh, i'm not saying not everybody is built to it nobody is you know born built you know you have to be built to it you know you have to be of certain age to experience things like uh, you have to experience anxiety and all these things and I'm, i'm not saying to you to read his work or to understand his work you have to go through anxiety or depression I'm not saying that but you know you have to be some but some but um uh mentally uh, strong i'm not saying i am but uh, you know uh i'm just depressed <laughs> i'm not depressed but uh, i say i want to say you know if you are 12 or 11 you know your mental strength is not much okay you are not physically even strengthful uh, you are not mentally you know good <laughs> i just want to put it out if you are 14 15 that's also you know too young Uh, but if you are 18 that's that's fine you know that's also not good but that's you know okay that's fine uh, but if you are 10 11 don't uh, don't read any philosophical book or any religious text that's not that's out of your business you know you don't you don't need those things just live your life you know with your friend all that thing experience puberty <laughs> experience uh, growth under your pit here growing under your pit pit <laughs> armpit you know experience that that something to experience you know that's one of lifetime experience first time experience um yeah dude i'm playing with this if you don't know what i'm doing with my hands i'm playing with this you know, just doing this thing i don't know if it come in the mic i don't think so it will come just it's opening and closing um i like the watch the color i don't watch i like i um this is i i don't care about the color you know if it's showing time that's more than enough uh, but 
it's fine color you know i like the black one <laughs> everything you know um, black is just a go to color you can just oh i'm going on to another tangent okay i will talk about frederick nietzsche nietzsche is okay so i have i myself had somewhat of a philosophy of my life it, like everybody has a philosophy of life you know like people talk about i am such a procrastinator that their philosophy you know that's their rule like they like procrastinating um some have like i'm hard worker you know um uh, i will hard uh, i will just do hard work and i will achieve goals that's their philosophy you know everybody you know in one way indirectly or directly knowingly or unknowingly have a philosophy of their life so what i'm going with this is i also uh, unknowingly but you know i had knowingly had a philosophy that you know if you want to get your goals you have to you know give up your happiness or you know you have to experience some kind of pain to get uh, your goals you know that i'm just it's too much cold dude now <laughs> no it's it's getting to my nerves you know i don't know i don't know it's coming to your voice but i'm just wearing this and you know uh, under a shirt which is also half sleeves um so i'm you know if my voice is just trembling because of cold uh, don't worry i'm not feeling cold <laughs> i'm feeling cold i'm feeling cold but that's one okay so you know that's my uh, that was my philosophy you know like uh, like uh, novel trafficant in john joe rogan's podcast just uh, put a podcast uh, put a quote out that you know um, but buddha said i think so i'm right i think so like buddha said that uh, uh, desire is what the fuck was that <laughs> uh, you know you make a deal uh till you get your goal you make a deal to be unhappy you know that was something of a quote and i was like oh dude this is something which you know uh i like or i it just you know whatever uh matches your philosophy you just start liking it um there was another quote from confucius that i don't think so now i'll put it out but I, i'm pretty sure he didn't but uh i just read it on instagram i think so uh it was like great men or great people are hard on themselves i'm not reading it from here you know great people are hard on themselves and soft on other that was some quote of confucius and i was like dude so i was like always thinking like david goggins also you know i i like him i don't love no you know i'm not i don't it's not nobody is my favorite okay i don't like favoritism that's some quote by kunal shah uh, founder of cred credit and fee charger but mainly from credit as you may know uh, mainly from credit from credit okay so uh, frederick nietzsche has also the same philosophy and this is the same like you know uh, the saying like you know you have to uh, the awkward truth of you know you have to experience some kind of pain to get to your goals and i, I really like you know these type of thing because uh it's like a business you know that's such i don't know what it just makes things way easier you know it is that's why people say you know hard work hard work because it's everything you know is this supply of pain your pain to get achievement so that's the thing i'm not prepared to make this video to that lot <laughs> if you guys are thinking i made no i didn't but i can talk about my teeth dude no <laughs> I will not okay I will not um um what to talk more about threatening the i like when pewdiepie was talking about him and i like his i i don't know i am not read anything but whatever you know i could get information about him uh, i'm not given my 100% but you know whatever i could uh, get from youtube videos i could and i'm talking about it and you know like you should live dangerously or you know what doesn't uh, kills you makes you stronger that are some of uh, frederick nietzsche's quotes um like i like these quotes you know like uh, if uh, he also says like if devil sees you and tells you that you have to live your life again and again uh, will you accept uh, you know will you say yes or you know just say no and you know if real man or the as he says i don't know i'm not i'm just saying whatever i could get and uh, uber man uh, as the strong man as he described like superman uber man would say yes and you know you should face reality 
really like in the saying like you should not drink alcohol uh, because you know not because it's bad for your health but because it just uh reduces the pain and you know you just run from reality i really like you know you should not run from reality you know you should just you know uh, just tell him like come dude you know you should tell life you know come on my face i will <laughs> not come on life. no uh, you know <laughs> um like come on you know i will fight you you know i want to live this again and again and again unlimitedly and you know if you are going to live uh this life again and again in a loop for infinite times you really want you know want something excitement and what more excitement than living dangerously by <laughs> my um i'm making another video okay don't forget